All right, guys, I just scanned over this rock pile. Um, and as you can see on the down imaging right there, right here, there's one fish and I just hit it on the left side because when I'm going down, that's shooting to the right. So I can tell there's, a, there's probably a lot more fish in these rocks that I can't tell. But right on the left side, there's one fish um, at least sitting on this rock pile. So we're gonna go So now that I'm lined up on the brush pile, I have my 360 running right now, and you can barely see it, but that's because I was moving right now, but it should pop up here in a, here in a second, a little bit clearer. And there's number one. All right. Uh, on that jigging spoon right there. It's a pretty good one. Let's see. Let's see how long he is. I only got a 15 inch measuring board. Um, I don't know if you guys can see that, but he's probably 16 and a half. Pretty, come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. 16 and a half inches, not a, not a half bad one. First one of the day. Good small mouth. It's another probably 16, 17 incher. Uh, you can see on the graph, there's a school of them down there sitting right on this corner. I'll show you. See all those fish right there? Those are the ones I was targeting. That good one. Let's measure him real quick, see what he's at. He's probably 17, 16 and a half. Somewhere right around there. It's a good one. That's number two, keeper number two of the day. Another big one. 
That's a big smallmouth right there, boys. Look at this one. This is a big one. Um, as you just saw, I just caught another good small mouth on the jig and spoon. Um, I caught, I had, I had it smack it twice. I pitched it into that do, uh, boat dock right there. I had it smack it twice and I didn't get it. And I put it back out there and uh, this one's probably 18, 18 inches. Let's measure it real quick. Mm -hmm. 